Well, if you must say, one more to your left. One more to your left. And one more, one more, as you walk, as you walk. Yeah. Look at us, look at us, as you walk. Yeah, yeah. And the front? Yeah. The front, please, mademoiselle. Just, yeah, the shoulder. There we go. The shoulder. Stay here. Thank you. Thank you. Right there. Right there. I like that train, bro. It's beautiful. Yes, thank you. Look at right that train. Perfect the way it is. It looks great. It's perfect. Logan, right here in the middle, please. Logan, hold that right there. One more, Logan. One more. One more, Logan. One second. One second. Right here. Hold that shot. Hey, bro. All right, film, TV lovers. I have the beautiful, elegant Miss Logan Browning. What up? How are you? How are you doing? I'm good. Good to see you. How does it feel to be an ambassador on this carpet with all these great actors, all your peers, on this great night? Uh, it's a huge honor. This is my first SAG Awards ever. And to be asked to be a SAG Awards ambassador, for me, made me feel really seen. Uh, because I never would have expected them to give me that honor, which made me a little sad to realize saying that out loud what that meant. And it meant that um, not many institutions have made me feel like I would be in a position like this. So I'm just grateful for the SAG After Foundation and the SAG Awards for always nominating people who deserve, who aren't always seen by other institutions. To be honest, Dear White People Cast should be among these great nominees and hopefully like maybe hopefully next year I mean at the end of the day at least for us and our show we do the work because it's important and because it means something to us it's our activism it's our art um, and so even though we haven't gotten nominated and, and granted awards by all of these things we have gotten into NAACP image awards which means so much to us we're nominated again this year which is incredible and we're very grateful. Um, we actually did something for our own writers and directors which is we did our own award ceremony last year because I and my cast wanted to make sure that our people felt like they had something to walk away from this hard work that they've done with, you know? And and I mean, so we always binge watch your seasons. I, I wonder when you're home and you're not, when you're not working, which I'm sure is not that often, what, what type of things are you watching these days? Okay, um, I just finished Cheer on Netflix. I highly recommend it. It's a very short watch, very good. Um, I just started The Outsider uh, with Jason Bateman on HBO. Um, and I'm catching up on movies now, so I'm actually trying to get to see everything. Just Mercy is next on my list. Well, Logan, whatever you watch, whatever you're in, we'll be watching too. So just keep on doing it. We'll keep on cheering you on. Thank you. The support is mutual, so I really appreciate it. You too. Thank you.